From the start menu, we will create a new project and we select the VMS protocol that we want to use. In that case, I will choose the KMX protocol and we look for the LG project. Entity's maps configuration process is intended to follow a left-right path to keep a step-by-step -step process. The first step is the, is the connection with the gateway. We can choose to connect by using USB cable or IP Ethernet cable. In that case, I will select USB COM port and click on connect. If the connection is successful, the information table will be populated. The second tab to follow is the configuration section. In that tab, we will set up the general configuration, the KNX specific configuration and the units on the LG side. General configuration will allow us to set general parameters as the device name, Ethernet configuration or project description. By default, the DHCP will be enabled for all our gateways. The second subsection is the KNX configuration. In this tab, we will set up the KNX physical address and the specific DPT values that we want to use for each HVAC object. The last section is the LG configuration itself. This tab allows the user to set up the machines that are present in the VUS. Although the configuration process can be done offline, offline, the best way to proceed is to perform a scan in the PI485 bus. This bus has been previously connected to the gateway. In the scan form, we can set the address range to scan, for example from 0 to V, and select the machine types that we want to automatically discover. You can press the scan button here and wait for the scan to finish. Once the scan is finished, we can just click on save and the table will be automatically filled with the discovered machines. We can also set general LG settings as the presence of a LG slave in the bus or enable the PDI feature for energy manage management purposes. The signal section shows the user all the available objects in the LG machines, both control and status, and allow the user to, to check or change the group address for each object. The last configuration section is the send process. Within this action, the configuration will be downloaded to the gateway. We can save the project first and the configuration will be sent. And last but not least is the diagnostic tab here. This tab is intended to be used as a diagnostic and troubleshooting and is one of the most powerful sections in the software. We can here inspect the available communication buses. The first one, the console viewer, shows the communication between the configuration, computer, and the gateway. The second one is the KNX viewer and shows the communication at the KNX side. And the third one is the LG viewer that shows the communication in the PI485 bus. We can inspect also the current values in all the available objects and we can simulate values by writing in the table if we want. For finish, you ha we have here the hardware test button that allows to perform our hardware in real time in the gateway.